My name is Zeke Gregory Corson. I'm from South Fulton, Tennessee. Video games. We've all played them, or we've all seen, so, or we've all watched as someone played them. Specifically, I'm talking survival games like Minecraft, Ark Survival, or maybe Terraria. What is the number one thing that can determine how long you can survive in these games? It's your shelter. And the most important, one of the most important parts of your shelter is the foundation you choose for your shelter. Turn with me to Matthew 7, 24 to 27. Therefore, whoever hears these sayings of mine and does them, I will liken him to a wise man who built his house on the rock. And the rain descended, the floods came, and the winds blew and beat on that house, and it did not fall, for it was founded on the rock. But everyone who hears these sayings of mine and does not do them will be like a foolish man who built his house on the sand. The rain descended, the floods came, the winds blew and beat on that house, and it fell, and great was its fall. So at first glance, this may seem to some people literally a story about two people building a house. One chooses to build a house on rock, the, and the other chooses to build their house on the sand. The floods, the rains come, the floods rise, the winds beat and blow on these houses. The man who built his house on the rock, his house is fine. But the man who built his house on the sand, his house collapses. However, if you, if you read it into it deeper, you realize that the rock, this is not a physical rock. The shelter is these people's faith. And the rock it will be heeding the teachings of Jesus during throughout your life, heeding the teachings of Je the teachings of Jesus. Following living your life on living a faithful life on the rock can lead to salvation, as presented through this story of the man who built his house on the rock. His good choice for a foundation presented his salvation. I've lost. As Jesus is ending his Sermon on the Mount, he leave, he tells the parable or a story as as a little choice to the people who have listened, who are there present listening. He presents them a choice. Heed, heed and live what he has said. And receive salvation. Or choose to not heed. And your house will collapse.